What is going on YouTube? Sir Winter coming at you with Assassin's Creed Valhalla. That's right, the team at Ubisoft Australia have given me a hands-on early preview. I get to sit here and play it for uh, five hours. So, oh my god, I am so excited. You guys know me, I love Vikings. Uh, and um, right now, I live in the dream. Assassin's Creed, one of my favorite genre, uh, one of my favorite stories of all time. One of my favorite uh, game series. And uh, now we've got it mixed in with Vikings and, oh god. Let's have a look here. Assassinate the old dummy. All right. So, in true Viking style, man, I think I'm going to go for a more... Eivor, what? That's me. How can I be of assistance? What's this? Decorative element. Ah! We'll chill on that for a sec. So let me explain something here. We're in a settlement right now. In our settlement. Here's the Great Hall. This is where we get all our quests and stuff. We're in England. And if any of you guys are watching Vikings, it's so funny actually. Uh, Pookie and I are watching Vikings right now. Her first ever run through of Vikings. And uh, the story takes place in one of the parts of Vikings where it uh, takes place. Uh, I, Eivor, uh, currently is, uh, joined up with Uber and, uh, Ivor, and is, um, is helping them out. So, right now, we're all in England. Uh, ooh, pet the cat. Oh my god. Alright, so I'd like to just point out as well that this is very, very early access. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. There are things I'm not allowed to show, apparently. There's some stuff that are out of bounds and stuff, so we'll... See what we can work with. Oh. Thought I was saying, give me the shield. Alright, so we're in the Great Hall. Wow. Alright. I'm gonna go get this, uh... Wait, interact? Can I eat? Or am I just stirring it? I mean, that's a big spoon. Alright, let's put that down. We're gonna go get our quest. What is... This is... Ivers or... Ubers? Or am I the leader of this settlement? Yes. All right, let's go. Good to see you. Good to see you. Word Give me a quest. Word of our growing settlement has reached outside ears, so have a look around. You may see a few new faces. Show me the alliance map. I want to see the alliance map. If you want your settlement to thrive in England, your clan must forge alliances. Pledge to a territory to confirm you're interested in an alliance. As pledges are completed and allies are made, other territories will be made available. Okay, so what are we in? Uh, Grand... Grand Bridgeshire. Or are we here? No, okay, so we want to do... Ledectrishire? Ledectrishire? <laughs> Holy crap. Ledectrishire. The Shire! Tell me more about Ledectrishire. Ledectrishire. Fuck! He traveled to a town called Repton. To meet Uba and Eva Ragnarsson. As I hear it, they are on the verge of exiling the current king of Mercia, with the hope of installing a king of their own. A bold endeavor. I should be there to help, however I can. I think you should. I won't keep them waiting. Good. I will send word to Sigurd and the Ragnarssons, pledging your assistance. If I were you, I would go by ship. Repton is quite a distance north on the River Trent. Alright, we've got a walls we've got a walls to go, I think. We're gonna to go to Repton. Which I believe is where they uh port. They put their ships at Repton. Oh yeah, we got the, our, our Raven. Ravensthorpe. So he can look around and stuff as well, and we can see the area. Alright, so we've got like activities and stuff everywhere. Alright, speak to Sigurd. Sigurd traveled northwest to a town called Repton. How do I get my horse? Right. Let's mount on up. Oh, you can press X to follow road. It's just as fast as you go. Ah, so we're in England. Taking over. We gotta go to Repton. Got a quest objective. What? I was going the wrong way. So that's gonna be handy, being able to do that. It's a good addition to any game like Red Dead 2, for example. Putting the follow road in. Alright, we're just gonna go off the beaten path here. Obsidian. Destroy and loot outcroppings of obsidian to gather resources. Okay, cool, cool. I like that type of stuff when it's put into Assassin's Creed. Like, uh, Assassin's Creed 3? So I'll just scream. With the, uh, Frontier. The Frontier was awesome. Alright, how are we gonna get across this river? You know what? We might just dismount, swim, 
Get on that boat and keep going. Hello, England. Civilian casualties will just result in desynchronization. So we got a shield that we can use as well. We got our power attack. Let's get our horse back. Dude, this is huge. We've still got two kilometers to go. <laughs> just to get to Repton. Okay, so, so far, it looks very, very nice. Oh. Wait, hold up, hold up. One Ford camp. Can I take this over? Best not to draw attention here. Okay, there we go. What have I got here? Right trigger. It's not unlike what our ancestors did. Assassinate. Dude, we're already doing one of these forts. Sick. What would a miracle cost? Better have a look. Nice, nice. Minor room of uh, minor room of life. All right, we got four guys down that way. Okay, we got a guys up on the uh, over there as well. Might be best to go for them. Where are they? No, they're over there. Okay. Oh fuck, there's two right here. Can I get a double assassination? What? I can't believe I missed that! Stop that bitch! Woo! <laughs> I'm coming, boy! Oh no, I missed the jump! Oh, what the fuck? Alright, I don't know what a counter-attack is yet. Archer behind me. Oh shit! With me here. Dodge! All right, where's this archer? I think he's up there. There. Feel my breath on your neck. Ugh. Come on, get up. Feel my breath on your neck. What the fuck? Where's this other archer? We have this. Oh, he's done, sir. Oh, fuck. Ah, man, come on up. Hey, yeah. You next? Oh. Quick scope, dude. All right, who's next? Get back here and face me. They're on dead. What do you see? I like food. Oh, nice. Oh, you hold right trigger. You can do power. Oh, okay. That's what that was. All right. So what's in here? Oh, the chest. That's a big looking chest. Carbon ingot, scout camps. All right, our wealth has gone up. Is that this place done? What's this? A backpack? Some silver? So is this gonna be, yeah. Beautiful. Gave myself a health pot, called my mount. Mount on up. Let's get going to Repton. Still so far away. Oh, what's this? Hey, they're Vikings. We must take over. We must take over this. Tamworth Fortress. 
No, I think they're still inside the fortress. But for now, we're going to try and get to Sigurd. I want to see what Sigurd looks like in this. Sigurd snake in the eye. Alright, here we go. We're on the road now. Out of the way, people. Wow. Look at that. Pretty. You're supposed to be able to call in a long ship as well. I wonder if I have that ability yet, because I'm not... I'm, I feel like I'm not at the start, obviously. Is this shallow? Yeah. So we're getting closer and closer to Repton. Man, so many Northmen around. Is that a boar for hunting? Alright. We'll just bag ourselves a couple of boar. Let's see what we get off them. Leather? Rations? Nice. I think that's for health. This feels very frontier out here, like from Assassin's Creed 3. By the way, why I've got you here, what's your favorite Assassin's Creed so far? I'd have to say Black Flag for mine. It was great. I was number one in the world on that uh, for a couple of things. Uh, most Deadliest Pirate, number one in the world on Xbox One for like a solid two weeks. I was the first person in the world to reach 10,000 kills on it. And uh, I was number two for the world's most wealthiest pirate or something. Wait, is this Repton? It is! Are you Sigurd Stranger? Uh, Igor! Eivor! If you keep that up, I'll stay in the floors. The place could use some color. <laughs> Who are they? All spies. Dressed to look the part of a peasant. Got feisty. Pitchfork. From this rabid little one. Was a time when you met and slew your enemy on the field before they could dream of things like sending spies. <laughs> now we shake hands and make deals. Not my thing. I figured. I love them whipped, weeping, and reeking of piss. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Good boy. You're free, Saxon piggy, to run amok through the mercy and fields. <laughs> I would have let him down easy. Hmm. Follow me. I'll give you the tour. Damn, Ivor. What do you call this place? I call it the shithole. To the Mercians, it is Reptar. Their most revered kings are buried below the church. Imagine their weeping when we drove them out. You planted your knife deep into the heart of this kingdom. That is right. We've got a number of Saxon nobles lined up with their lips puckered, ready to kiss our asses. I would do have a quirky walk, though. Is King Burgred and his war thane, Leofrid. But my brother is brewing a plan to deal with them. I take it that's where we'll find my brother. Right. Talkers they are, Uba and Sigurd. Might want to dig the wax from your ears. Alright, so we've met up with Ivar Ragnarsson. And we're going to meet up with uh, Sigurd Snake in the eye right now. Is this him? No, I was going to say, it's a pretty common looking guy. Is he playing the Ood? I know, Berger. I'm not going anywhere, Bakrat. You have the king on his heels because of me. Because of my men. For which you were paid. But that price does not change. Oh, we're meeting up with Uba. A whiff of our hex silver hoard. You forget I am a sellsword. I ask what I please, and I take what I'm owed. If I wanted to hear you talk shit, I'd gouge out your tongue and shove it up your ass. Now fuck off. <laughs> 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 
Haggling over silver is a bad look That's for the son good. of Lodbrok. But worry not, Uba. I have the warriors you need. This is one of them. My worries have vanished. Eivor, wolf kissed. You have come at just the right time. Uba and Ivar here are hunting a king. And when we've caught him, we mean to crown another. Our dear Thane Shellwolf here. It's not a role I begged for, but it's what Mercia needs just now. A man to fairly rule both Saxons and Danes. Ah, so we got options. Nice. Viking rule through a Saxon king. The current king will want your head. Are you fit to rule a kingdom? Viking rule through a Saxon king. The current king will want your head. Here we go. It sounds like you'll be a king in name only. A puppet. I am doing my part. I hope you have come to do yours. We're going to need all the help we can get for what comes next. The king has refused our offers of peace. Jailwolf means to change that. There'll be a new king for a new England. For now, Burgred is holed up in his fortress at Tamworth, making a final stand. Another shithole. Only further south. We've held a siege there for weeks to no effect. So, no more knocking. Now we batter the gate to splinters. If we take Tamworth, remove Burgred and crown Shailwolf, come morning this shire is ours. And Mercia soon after. Yes. Remove. I cannot stress that enough. Burgred is not to be harmed. My legitimacy as king hangs on this one simple fact. Uh, you rob all the joy from war, Saxon. Not every victory needs to be marked by the slaughter of a king. Ah, but it is much better. His request is fair, Ivar, and we will honor it. Chairwolf betrayed his present king. Maybe tomorrow he betrays us too. Why trust him? How can I answer that with any hope that you'd believe me? I only want what is best for the people of Mercia. And I want what's best for my son. In Burgred's Mercia, where Danes and Saxons murder one another daily, it's not possible. This is a good plan, brother. I'm ready for the coming fight. Agreed. Yet remember this. Whatever you stand to gain here, so do we. An alliance between my clan and Mercia's crown. See this man installed on his throne and you will have it. I swear. The bold sons of Ragnar bellow to sound the spear din and the thunder of shields. So let fall the arrow storm. The battle begins. Ah! You never said this one was a poet. I need to piss. <laughs> We have a forward camp just north of Tamworth. Will you go with us? Lead the way. Take in the sights of Repton if you like. We will be at the docks when you are ready to go. I'm glad you and your brother have come. If only to bring some measure of calm. Ease yourself, Cheerwolf. We all stand to benefit, and you'll be remembered for this for years to come. For all the wrong reasons, I fear. Okay, excellent. The Kingmaker's Saga. Looks like we're headed to Tamworth. I want to hear some sagas sung, man. I want to hear some sagas sung on these ships. King Harold's, uh, my mother told me that song, man. I fucking love it. Love it. Woo. Damn, hey, I'm a little slob there. Bring the men to the gates of Tamworth. We'll flood the fields and able. Sorry. Is your axe sharpened? I'm ready for the spear din. And the thunder of shields. Yes. It's good to have you with us. To fight beside such legends is an honor. I've only heard tales of your conquests. Now I get to live them. We'll weave our sagas together. Thread upon thread. Come on, boy. We'll forge a man from your softness. Hammered on the anvil of does war. does need to fight to be Move. a... Move! Move! Calm, Ivar. The fight's not here. Aye. The fight is nowhere to be found in this boy. A boy who happens to be Chilwolf's son. Why is he not in his quarters? Our future king wants a battle-hardened heir. Time he proves his worth, don't you think?
can't be an heir if he's dead, Ivar. Can he wield the sword? I've had some training. I only... I don't want to kill anyone. These men are my friends. My countrymen. Relax, little king. They won't call you friend now. You can thank your father for that. Ivar! He comes with us. And should anything happen to this little sprout, I will bear the punishment our future king inflicts. He'll want to remove your head. Haha, <laughs> you hear that, boy? You die, and I'll have to kill your father, too. <laughs> he better not die, then. Mount up, Eivor. It's a long ride to Tamworth. Really? You have to endure, my brother. He always finds new ways to humor hey! himself. No. I'll keep that in mind. And both eyes open. You smell that, Chailbert? The stink of jealousy. Of our budding friendship, I think. Alright, so I'm going with Uba, Iva, and Sigurd. It's Jail Wolf's way of proving his loyalty. And there's no safer place for a traitor and his son in the middle of a pack of days. <laughs> Safe from who? You and Ivar seem to have brought this child to hell. Fears are with us, the common folk. Urgred still has his soldiers all over Mercia. They're devoted to him, and they'll die defending him. Your voice, Eivor. You sound different than the brothers. Good ear, Lord. Most in England cannot tell the difference. Not all Danes are Danes. From where do you come, if I may ask? North of the Danelands. A place called Fonberg in Norway. I didn't know there was land north of there. What are the people like? Do you ever see a herd of sheep follow each other off the edge of a cliff? They're like that. The ones who remain, anyway. Couldn't have said it better myself. Was it a mass huh? exodus from Norway, then? It was. Norway is now the province of a young king, Harald by name. A boy king Harald! beyond his years. Are you not angry that he has displaced you and so many others? I was, for a time. But our weeks at sea have softened my brow fire. If I am honest, I realize I quite admire King Harald. By words and by weapons, both. He has pacified the country I call home. For the first time in any man's memory, or any scald song, Norway has one king. Just one. And that is quite a feat. That is impressive, truly. England is half the size of Norway, and yet we have four kings for our four kingdoms. You see? How could I not be impressed? No, Harald is a good man with grand ideas. I can see that now. I am only six years his junior, and have yet to see my first battle. I cannot imagine the skill and cunning he has. Your first battle is coming, young Tilbert. From this day on, you may see rapid progress. I'm not sure I want so swift a rise. What do we got here? Danes? In truth, Jill. Yeah, it's a Danish ship. It is my father who bears the heaviest weight of my anger. Not King Harold. My father gifted my birthright to Harold without my consent or knowledge. As easily as if he might hand over a barrel of meat. It was not merely a deception, it was a betrayal of trust. The prick of which still stings me. Be it a blessing or a curse, family is always first. A good line, boy. Were you not an Adeling, I would hire you as my scold. Scold? It sounds something like Scott, our court poets. Is that what you mean? Right again. Fascinating. The harmony between our words and yours is quite something. As if we were distant cousins, separated by an ocean of time as well as space. <laughs> I like the thought of that. I do. So we're traveling with the son of the... Uh... What will be the future king with Uba, Sigurd, and I Iva. Are we going to dethrone him right now? Surely not. So I guess we're taking over this fort. Is the king here? There's a great hall up the back and everything. Yes. Watch out. Look at these pagan rats. Ravenous, unseemly beasts teeming over holy ground. Have a care, Lord. Those pagan rats are numbers. I can see that, fool. What do we do about them? 
I advise we strongly consider their demands, Lord. We won't survive a fight. Is that you, Leofrit? How quickly you recover! I'm beginning to wonder if it is a man or a god beneath all that armor. A man of God stands before you, Eva. Proud and resolute. That's Burgred's war thing. Killed a dozen of our men in an ambush along the River Trent. It was Ivar's ex that stopped him. That is a poor description of a perfect 30-yard toss. Enough jawing, heathens! Speak your peace! We've come for your crown, Lord. With or without your head attached. Ha, I admire your ambition, pagan. But what you ask is impossible. No Dane ever has, or ever will, occupy Mercia's sacred throne. Would you settle for a Norse? We're not as gentle, but we're much better poets. <laughs> Norse, Dane, dog, you're all the same to me, all godless. My king, may I suggest a more measured approach to this? I grow weary of this palaver. You have trampled our lands, toppled our monuments. We've given you silver, fed your people. And yet, in spite of all this, your encroachment on my kingdom continues. No more! We will die defending what is ours, whatsoever the cost. If you want my crown, Uber Ragnarsson, you must pry it from the hands of my bloodless corpse. Man the walls! Well, I guess that's exactly what's gonna have to happen. Back to the camp. Round up the men. We're taking Tamworth tonight. The camp. Hey, oh. Tell the captain we're ready to march. Ivar and I will round up the men. Do you know your way around a batwing ram? I've seen them in action. I want you at the helm of ours. You're strong and agile. I'll be there. I'll yes. Be there. Fuck yeah! I get to do the battering ram. Looking for a wordy Who are you? I'm with the Ragnarsons. It's time to roll out the battering ram. Birgred wanted a fight. Now we'll give him one. Are you ready to march now? Let's go. It's time to capture a kingdom. What are we going to do about him? Jailbird. Something wrong. I know these men, Eivor. I've supped with them. Not two weeks ago, Leofrith showed me how to wield a greatsword. He's a friend. Friendships end, often at the point of a spear. It cannot be that cold. Least of all with Leofrith. He is only following orders. When the march begins, find an empty tent and stay there. Do not think me a coward. I am not afraid of war. I do not want to kill my friends. There's no other way. Fight or hide. It's up to you. Man, I understand him, but if you're going to be future king, you might want to get out there with him. Oh, we got explosive pots? I know it because they're red. <laughs> Tamworth. Fortress. It's weird that there's already a great hall up the back there. Alright, let's get this ram up there. Destroy the gate! Slaughter the soldiers! Leave the king to me! Can I jump on this? Watch out! Ooh! Forward! Push forward! We're gonna be climbing the ladders and everything. Come on, let us in. Interact. Get made some of this. Oh yeah, boy, we're making some progress now. It's cracking, Bryce. Shields up. 
All right, charge. Oh, it's coming down. It has to give way very shortly here. Ah. Let's just charge on the battering ram, bro. Fight them off the battering ram. Oh no. Shit, I've knocked too many people off. <laughs> I just got knocked down behind us. I'm worried about them. Oh shit. Oh, thank God. Oh, get out of the fire. Get out of the fire. Go, 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 go. Dude, we're just opening all the doors right now. Alright, keep them off us. Ah, shit, that hurt. Race. Come on, Uber. Uber! Oh, my God. I'm gonna have to do this guy myself. We broken the door? Oh, fuck. The stomp thing's great. I think they just broke the door. Yeah, Tam workers get stored. Alright, so we need to push on up. Oh. Let's keep moving. We're about to king get King Bugred. I, don't, I can't remember who this king is. It sounds familiar though. And here we are. Who are these people? Alright. Oh, fuck. They hurt. Stop, stop. Jesus. Stop him. Yes. Assault complete. Where's the king? <laughs> In here. It's over, Bergred. Lay down your weapons and surrender. Ah, he's escaped, has he? Take three men and search the rear. Look around. See what you can find. I'll send for Chael Wolf. Tell him we found a throne. Royal ledger to the almighty king. Ivar, I found a letter. There's a symbol here. Your men have any luck? Nothing. You? This. Do you know that symbol? Tana Sigil. It seems she's been dealing with Burgred as well. The wretch. She was the mercenary barking at you in Repton, yes? She's playing both sides of this war. She could have told him anything. Sold him secrets about me, about Repton. Our plans. Why bother with all this pageantry? Fashion a new crown and stick it on your melon. There you have it. You're the new king. That is not how it works. Not in Mercia. We are wasting time. Tana is our only lead. We talk to her. Find out what she knows. I would sooner launch my face into my axe than face her. That might improve her impression of you. We have the same father, Eivor. But his mother was a sow. Meet us at Tona's camp when you're finished here. And bring your patience. And your axe! 
Eivor, a word, if you would. Go, I'll catch up. I will join the brothers, Eivor. Meet us at Tonas. My son told me what happened earlier, with Ivar pressuring him to fight. He said you intervened. You would be mourning your son if I hadn't. <laughs> He's not a fighter. No, but he should be. By trial or by training. He'll come around in time. But keep him from Ivar if you can. He's the furthest thing from a mentor. True. He has the mind of a child. He's a psycho. As Sigurd once said. Alright. We have a bit of traveling to go. So, let's call in the horse. Let's head there.